everyone, welcome back to my garage. And at the beginning of the video, you saw the GM9000 ID running the entire house, okay? And uh, I gotta say, I have a gas stove and I have a gas dryer. That's the, the thing that helps, right? But when you saw the clock cycling between 48, 4900 watts, the fridge was running and the two ways air conditioners were running, you know? At some point, you saw that the clock jumped to 61, 6300 watts. Then there I start the coffee machine, the washer and dryer. So the entire house running at around 61, 6300 watts is not bad. Now, the question is how I'm able to run the entire house with the GM9000 IED when I limited to only 50 amps? Well, the secret is my two AC units have a easy started. And easy started lower the amps that the air conditioner need to run. Let's take a look. Okay, here are my two AC units, but first let's go to the label. And here, let me see, oh, here it is. So 79 LRA, what it means is that this unit needs 79 amps to start the compressor and the fan. And with the easy start, I'm able to start this generator with only 26.8 amps. And then that those amps drop to only 10. Um, let's check the other one. Okay, here is the other LRA on the label. This AC unit start with 48 amps. With the easy start, I, I believe I'm able to start it like at 16 uh, amps and then that drops to four amps. Okay, so here I have my two easy starter. I put, I install it inside this box. I have a 368 model and a 364. This one is for my three tons AC and this one is for my two ton AC. So basically I have a total five ton unit uh, at this house. Um, if I had only one five ton unit, I only need one of these units, but you know, I have two, so I have, I need two different units for this one. And these two units, as you see, come with a Bluetooth feature that you can uh, monitor and diagnose uh, using an application from the manufacturer. So it's really cool. I installed it here and what I did is I added extra cable and um, but when they come they come at least I think it is like two three feet of cable so most of the people install this next to the AC unit um, I want to mount it here on the wall so I added cable to this but this is the micro air easy start this is what you need to lower your LRA or amps uh, starting from your AC units. And that would allow you to run your generator uh, with only 50 amps and the whole house, basically. Okay, guys, so I did the math and my three-ton AC unit LRA is 79, but with the AC star is 26.8 and the running amps will be 10.1. My two-ton AC unit um, LRA is 48, with the easy start will be 16.4 and will run with 4.2. Without the easy start, let's say both these AC units start at the same time, that is very unlikely, but happen, will be 127 amps and you go above the 50 amp limit that you have with your generator. So that's why you wanna use an easy start. With the easy start will be only 43.2 amps and then that will drop once it's running to 14.3 amps allowing you to run anything else that you have at your house because 50 amps from the generator minus 14.3 do the math and whatever is left is enough for you to run anything else around the house okay so and the easy start provide you basically up to 75 percent amps uses reduction from your ac units so it's it's, it's very helpful I highly recommend you to get one of those if you are gonna use uh, your generator to run your house and your AC, okay? I'm gonna leave in the, a link in the description below where you can find the AC start and also the generator if you like the generator. And uh, again, guys, if you like this video, if you find the information helpful for you, give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and see you in the next video. Bye.